Good morning. Today is February 22nd, which is a really big day because it's the day that my MCAT score comes back. Um, I am really, really terrified. I've been waiting for more than a month at this point and my MCAT has like somehow been able to slip into my dreams. Um, it's, it's quite scary. I had a dream where I got like a 470, which I don't think is even possible, but hopefully that won't happen today. So the plan for today is I... I'm not going to open my MCAT score until later this evening because I have a really big physics exam that's um, five o'clock today. And knowing myself, I know that if I open it before, it's going to really distract me from studying. So I'm planning to just completely focus on, well, at least try to completely focus on my physics exam and then open my score later. And you guys will follow me along for that, I guess. I made a previous video talking about my experience immediately after testing day, so if you haven't seen that, go watch it. I talk about my feelings on every single like section, so we'll see if that holds accurate. But as far as like the total score goes, I didn't really give a, a number for that, and um, the number that I have in mind is a 510. I know that for a lot of people that score isn't sufficient and that they would retake a 510, but Knowing myself and what schools I want to go to, I feel that anything above a 510 would help me achieve that. And that's not to say that if I got below a 510, I wouldn't, or that I necessarily would retake it. But um, I guess that's that's just like my goal. That's the number that I have in mind. Anything above that, I'd be ecstatic. Anything below that, I think I'd be a little bit less than happy, especially because my, um, my full length average was about a 510. It was a little bit above 510, but um, it was about 510. And yeah, so I will, I don't really have much else to say. I'm going to try to study for my physics exam and I will see you guys later um, when I'm opening my MCAT results. Oh my gosh, it's so scary. Okay. I'm not ready. <laughs> um, okay. Okay. Um, I'm like really scared now. No, you'll be great. Thanks. <laughs> okay, now I'm forgetting how to log into this thing. Oh no, I think I... Let's restart it. No, it's fine, it's fine. Just keep it rolling. I'll just cut it out. <laughs> um, let me see. MCAT. Okay. Getting there. <laughs> no, that... What? Why can I not find... Okay, um, um, give me a second. I, I've like gone to the page so many times, but like now that I actually need to go get something, like I don't. Okay, get your test scores. Wait, I don't know if I want to look at this. Do you want to look at it for me? No, no, you look at it. Um, few scores. Yes, few, few. Press it. Taylor. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, okay. That's not great. What'd you get? What'd you get? I got a 507. Okay, that's good! That's not bad. No, it's not bad. It's not what I was aiming for, but... You did really okay. good, Taylor. I don't know how to feel about this. Taylor, you did really good. I don't know how good. to feel about it. No, don't be hard on yourself. You did really good. I think that's usable. Of course. <laughs> it's higher than the average. Sorry, I'm like freaking out. Okay, um, psych soch was definitely like my worst section. And I knew that coming out of the testing center. Aww. But I did not do as well as I wanted to in the other one, which is a little bit sad. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I should retake it or if I should keep it. Is that a lot of difference? Like three points? Mm. It's 69th percentile, so. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's better than good. 50, but I don't know. I don't know. I was definitely hoping for higher. Mm. Well, if I you really feel make up my mind it. later yeah. <laughs> about this. Um, I'll probably talk to my to my parents. Mm -hmm. And I mean, okay, I feel like that's realistic though. Like, yeah, of course. No, you did great. <laughs> okay. Yay! It's over. You did it. Wait, you should come over here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good job, Taylor. That's my breakdown. 
that's pretty yeah, good. That, that's, that's all I have. I don't really know what else to say. I think I need to like absorb a little bit more. Okay, um, that was Ashley who was there with me. She is an angel. I'm so glad she was there because I think I would have been way too terrified if she wasn't there um, to open it with me. But I, I just called my parents and I called my boyfriend and told them about it and I was a little bit disappointed but I, I was also conflicted because I think 507 was the score that I told myself was the border of where I would retake it so I wasn't sure if I wanted to retake it or if I didn't want to retake it but after talking to them and googling some school averages and everything I think I've decided I'm going to move forward with this year's application. Um, I will plan to possibly retake it but I think that'll depend on other things. I think the rest of my application is strong and I think my score is good enough to get me in the door. I don't think it's stellar but um, considering that I I was a full-time student um, and I had an internship and I was volunteering and I had all these things going on um, I think I think it's okay. I watched so many of these before I made this and everyone was like getting like a 525 and really high scores and maybe this will be a more realistic one. I think I'm still gonna put this on the internet. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want to see how I studied for my MCAT or more information about pre-med stuff. I'm very happy to do that. Um, but yeah, for now, that's it. I'm going to continue working on my application as I have been for the last month and um, just keep going. I think I think it's okay. I'm glad it's over with now. Officially over with because I have my score. And yeah, that, that's it. Thank you for watching this video.